outside, I had to take the dog out. And it's kind of cold. I probably would have went for a run at this time, but it's too cold for that. Maybe you went to... Maybe now you live in Inaba. Or Silent Hill. Alright. So before we move on with the plot, I think we can actually get, uh, the, uh, buh, buh, buh. well, well, can't think of which fruit it is, but it's the one that, uh, Sully needs, which I think can be dropped by the green clay in, in, in the North Labyrinth. Dragon Blade? No, I'm working on that. That takes a lot of coins to get, that Dragon Blade. Yeah, see, there, there, there it is, the green clay. We want to farm, farm on the green clay for Sully's fruit. That's what we want to do. Yeah, I, I am. Da -na 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 -na. It's actually easier to do it in the North Labyrinth. I know we could just wait for the, uh... The, uh, b -b 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 Egg Dragon to get all the fruits, but, you know. I like to get them as early as possible. There's the green clay. Do, 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 do. Firebirds, all we gotta do there. Ironically, both the green clay and, and the sangorum drop fruits. Also, I've been told there is an island near the beginning of the game where all the enemies actually drop fruits on the overworld. I've never really done that, but... Not too worried about it. Hey, where are you going, man? Where are you going? I never bother with it. It's not really necessary. Plus, if you're trying to get a certain one, you never know which one you're going to end up getting, so... Bum, bum, bum. Da, da, da. Yeah, the, that, that's the good thing about reset if you're trying to farm on a specific enemy. You can just do the battle, cast reset, and do it again. You, 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 you don't have to worry about like leaving the dungeon and coming back. Just do reset. It is pretty sweet. To steal? I don't think so. SNES? You're not familiar with Lufia 2? Come on, man. Get with the freaking program. Da -na 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 -na. Although I'm not sure if casting reset, if it gives you the same RNG each time. Maybe it does. I'm not sure, so I should probably be doing different attacks. To manipulate it and such, we'll just do all attacks. Whatever, man. Because, you know, to... To, to, to manipulate the RNG in this game, you gotta do different attacks. That's how it works, man. 
Da -na 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 -na. Oh yeah, you don't have Firebird, do you? Ba -ba -ba. Da -na 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 -na. I don't know if I have one on. I know I did have the 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 Sizzle Sword. What do I have on now? S Civil Rapier. So that's a thing. Bum bum bum. Uh, let's see. Do, 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 do. Well, let's do Fireball. Because, you know, that's different. It's different. Breeze Fruit. There we go. See? All it took was Fireball. Alright. I don't remember if he needs to be in the max level or if it's... Or if it's something else. We'll go ahead and... Because some of the capsule monsters have to be in certain... Uh, certain forms in, in order to get to their final form. Abusu... Absuing. Absuing. Yeah, originally I wasn't even planning on streaming tonight, but I just had a sudden urge. A sudden urge. Let's see here. Okay. Breeze fruit. What does a, a Moya statue become? It becomes a centaur. Okay. Sure, why not? Okay. Centaur! Battle bow, hammer punch. Max form, 12 magic resistance. How sad is that? 38 agility. But he's got max guts. And fun fact, you... You can't go over 199 guts. Like, like you can with all other stats. I don't know why. Just 199 is like the max. So. So that's a thing. Alright. Okay. We may be able to get some of the... Uh, uh, let's see. We only need, uh, I think... Two more fruits, because we already have Zeppies. I'm not sure if you can get them at this point, but I'm not going to worry about it right now. Because we need to advance the plot. Uh, let's see. E -e 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 I have six viewers. Okay. So we need to head north to Agaro. Uh, Minotaurus. Was seven before. Yeah. You know how my viewership goes. It fluctuates. All the time. It very rarely sticks to one thing. Yes. Some games, is it's a lot easier to manipulate RNG, like Earthbound. It kind of depends on how... how heavily RNG-based a game is. Yeah, I changed the size of the window. Hopefully, ho hopefully that didn't mess up the stream window. It probably did. Yeah. We'll give the brave to you. Yeah, I I changed the size of my game window so I could see the viewer list. 
Okay. So we're heading north to Agaro. Which I always thought was named after Agaro from Fortress of Doom. I don't know that it actually is, but... Ah, I've always kind of thought it was. Dude, Terminal Blow's not gonna work on a character that has the Undead Ring, sorry. It's just not gonna happen. Ba -na 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 -na. Bum bum bum. Shells levels up. You gotta go this way. Mad heads. Bum bum bum. Firebird. Yeah, we are quite over leveled. But then again, I mean, this game's not really that difficult anyway. Uh, uh other than like the super bosses. But other than that, they, this game's not really considered that difficult. Especially if you know it as well as I do. Even in lower levels, you're probably not going to struggle much. You know, unless you're in the Ancient Cave. You probably struggle there. Lexus. He's not exactly a physical character, but that's okay. Plus, the uh, the Medusa's a pretty high de physical defense. Small Shrine to Agaro. I heard someone attacked Agaro. People say the man in the tower did it. Yeah, well, he probably did. Agaro! I like how if you talk to this guy, no text box appears, but your characters face his direction. Like, whatever, man. Well, Salon does. Guy and Lexus just don't give a crap, so. That's how that goes. Oh, the, oh, the little kid died. It's so tragic. Iris is just hanging out. When I got here, it was already too late. Even if you had come in time, you would have been destroyed just like these people. I doubt it. I somehow doubt it. You're probably right. I couldn't have done anything all by myself anyway. If only I had defeated Amon at that tower, this wouldn't have happened. Maxim, I've been telling you that your mission in life is to travel and fight, but not now. What do you mean? You've fought enough. Discard your sword and return to a peaceful life in Parcelite. Well, that's fickle. Why do you say such a thing all of a sudden? Your power is not enough to defeat Amon. Next time you fight, you'll be destroyed. I think that's pretty unlikely. <laughs> it's true that Amon was strong, but you'll never know until you really face him and fight. I, I just can't forgive Amon for destroying so many innocent people. Your energy waves. I sense very good energy from you. What? I feel rage, but you're in control. With these energy waves, you may... I may defeat Amon? The key to winning in battle against a Sinistral is energy. And, you know, like, high levels and such. Would you explain that for me? The Sinistrals are energy held in a physical temple. To defeat them, you must destroy their energy. But your energy isn't strong enough to destroy Amon. How can I get stronger? Level up, you fool! Energy waves come from the way you feel or think. You can't get physic you can't physically gain strength, but 
But what? There's a sword that amplifies energy waves. Oh boy. A sword that amplifies energy? It's called Dual Blade. It resonates to the energy waves of its possessor, intensifying his power. Dual Blade? Do you know where I can find this blade? I do not know. It may be only a legend. I see. Still, just believing that it may exist gives me courage and strength. So you will go on to battle, I see. Even if your own end awaits you. It's harder for me to run away than to face my own destruction. I shall not hold you back then, but I cannot leave these people like this. Would you help me? Of course. Yeah, all right. So did we all bury them in one little tombstone? That's kind of, uh, odd. May there be eternal peace for those who have suffered. They will go to paradise, won't they? Yes, they will. Sir Maxim, what are you going to do now? I don't know how to begin, but I'll look for Amon and Dual Blade. I saw a ball of light fly south in the sky when I got here. That might have been Amon. Maybe. I see. Well, I should go now. Yeah, go do your mysterious things. Iris. Would you tell me someday who you really are? The time will come for me to tell you. Although I don't know if you'll know it's me when I show you my true self. Oh, you'll find out soon enough, Maxim. We'll talk about it when you're older. Okay. Na 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 na. So next up, we need to head to Trouble. Which I think is on our warp list already, isn't it? Yep. Trouble! Not base, but Trouble. Well, why is everybody so close together? The ball of light flew into the southwestern sea from the north. People are freaking really bad. Oh, they're freaking, are they? When I think of that ball of light hidden in the sea, I can't get near the water. What was that ball of light? It went into the sea, and that's where I hope it stays. I've, nev I've never seen such a weird light in my entire life. It must be a sign. The end of the world. It's a sign, all right. Is it true that Agrio was destroyed by the spooky man? That ball of light also came from the direction of Agrio. Is there a connection to Agrio? Maybe. There's a lab of strange inventions. The inventors got excited over a sinking ship when I was there. Oh, that must be Kermo. Who's that? A friend. He's, he's researching submarines, you see. Submarines? They're ships that can go under the sea. When a ship goes under the sea, it's called sinking. No, dummy. Submarines dive underwater. They don't sink. Hey, hey, calm down. Are all your friends like that? <laughs> okay, that's great. Ba, ba, ba. My boyfriend is a sailor in Portravia. He said he saw that ball of light really close up. He said that way the ball of light went into the sea was divine, yet mysterious and scary. Uh-huh. So we want to go to Portravia next. Do you know that ball of light was? My grandpa says it must be a super being. Eh, maybe. That ball of light must be a super being, although I sense a somewhat evil energy too. Hope the ball of light that went under the sea will never return to this side of life. That's eh, probably just Frieza. Is it really true that a ship can go under the sea? Wouldn't you like to know, kid? Do you know the legend of dragon eggs? No, I don't. On a tiny island in a lake facing Pico Village to the southeast lives a dragon who collects dragon eggs. When you collect the eight dragon eggs, the dragon will grant you a wish. Of course, nobody who's even got close to the small island has come back alive. It's not that hard, man. Well, once you get a submarine, at least. Oh, you knew about it already. 
Everybody seems to sense energy. They've all been training with Master Roshi, apparently. Yeah, okay, people are still freaking. It's crazy. Smoke ball? It escapes from battle. Okay, whatever. Don't need to worry about that nonsense. We have all the items you will need on your journey. Bathroom visit. How is the bathroom doing? Pounder rod. A rod with a hammer attached to it. Do, 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 do. Get a circlet for Lexus. Circlet of metal that you place around your forehead. Has a nice magic resistance boost. That's pretty sweet. Tough buckler we don't need. Okay. Ba, ba, ba. What's this guy doing back here? Yeah, okay, we, 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 we already talked to that little pool expert. Do we need to sleep? Yeah, kind of. Okay, we need to go to Botavia.